Hey Josh, did you see all the fishermen this morning below the dam? Those plywood flashboards on the top of the dam really give us more hydraulic head to work with in the plant. However, they blow out periodically. When they go, when they go, a four-foot wall of water plunges over the 20-foot dam and goes right through where some of the people like to fish. They wouldn't be able to get out of the way in time. I think we really should install a better flashboard system. No, no. We have already talked about that. A new robust system costs 10 times the amount of what we spend on the plywood flashboard. We are barely making ends meet as it is. They hardly ever fail when people are fishing there. Yeah, but remember last year, three people got stranded out on the dam and had to be flight rescued. And then the year before that, two or three similar cases happened. We should not allow people to access that area. Uh, we have signs up already that say we don't assume any risk for fast rising conditions. Fish at your own risk. Plus, the community really enjoyed that fishing access. Yeah, but everybody that fishes down there, they don't understand the risk. Uh, sure they do. It's right on the sign. Plus, that is not our decision as engineers. That is for management. Josh, I can't believe it. One of the flashboards just blew out on the dam and an elder fisherman standing on the dam apron was washed out into the river and drowned. Three people tried to jump in and save him, and they ended up having some trouble themselves. I can't believe it. We should have done something about that problem a long time ago. Okay.